Mom? Dad? What are you guys doing home already? It's not even dark out yet. Stunned employees were turned away from Eagle Capital's offices in New York and here in Philadelphia. Eagle today. Capital? The firm's That's where you were, Daddy. Rumored for weeks as Eagle's There's something uh, partners. we Company have to tell you. Could not be reached for comment. <clears throat> Darling, we need to talk. Oh, I know. <laughs> Did you know that these things don't work all the time? This one's, like, broken or something. Sweetheart, we have a bit of bad news. You mean besides this? Daddy lost his job. So, we'll get a new one, right? Yeah, sure, eventually, but... In the meantime, um, we are going to have to cut back, make some changes. You're not cutting back on my clothing allowance, are you? Because due to my new exalted position, my dress for the formal needs to be couture. I was thinking Marc Jacobs, at the very least. It's a little worse than that, I'm afraid. We're broke. That's not bad news. That's a nightmare. He hasn't changed a bit. What? A dump. Certainly gonna need a thorough cleaning. Oh no, he doesn't need a cleaning. He needs to be fumigated. Honey, nothing a little elbow grease can't change. Nothing a little bulldozer wouldn't fix. Stop it. It's a horse, silly. Hi. Gypsy Vanner. He's homeless, like us. No, Gypsy Vanner is the breed. It's awfully sweet. And I have to say, quite handsome. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, oh. It slimed me! Oh, where's the bathroom? Horse cooties, ew! What are you doing? Listening. To what? I don't hear anything. Shh, shh, shh. Exactly. Oh, no phones. No traffic. No nothing. Oh no. It's so annoying. Maybe not. What? Mama, we're broke. We're stuck out here in the middle of nowhere. I don't even get cell coverage anywhere. And there's a horse living inside of our house. It's it's a nightmare. Oh, 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 oh. Maybe it's a blessing in disguise, okay? For all of us. One. I'm counting down the days until we get back home where we belong. You know, they say that home is where the heart is. My heart is wherever you are.
you're a stalker. Has anybody ever told you that? You know, back home we have names for kids like you. Wannabes, leeches, and ugh, hangers on. Now get! Look, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. Come on, don't be mad. Horsey! Come here! Are you hiding? Horsey! Here, horse, here! Look, I said I'm sorry. What else do you want from me? Animal, you sure can hide. Here, horse. Here, horsey, horsey. Oh my God. I, Whitney Brown, am talking to a dumb animal. <laughs> So I thought I should make an extra special effort. I think Bob was enjoying watching me get the hang of country life. I'm going to tell you the number one rule about parties. You have to arrive in style. That's why we're saddling you all up. And now we're ready to go. <laughs> I don't know if that's such a good idea, sweetheart. I mean, you don't even know if he's saddle broken. <laughs> or if you are, for that matter. Maybe I'll just stick with bareback. Enhanced shine body and manageability. Can it hurt, huh? Okay. Ready to have some fun? Hey, it's raining. <laughs> Manicure or pedicure? Huh? Huh? What do you think? <laughs> you know, we would have some snacks if you would have just stayed put like I told you. I'll walk a bit and give you a break. I've been working really hard all day. Maybe we should try to avoid the main roads. The kid on a horse might draw unwanted attention when we get close to the city. Hey, hey, hey what? All oh, right, Scrum stole me out issues. You should probably see someone about that. I can't believe that I ever 
waste your life for a stupid school formal. Pull up, come on. You're all I am.